That's right, that's Gulf Shores. That's right, we're at Bahama Bob's, one of the most famous spots on the beach here in Gulf Shores. If I can't remember anybody who hasn't come to Gulf Shores and been to Bahama Bob's. And if you haven't, shame on you, because they got great food here, and it's, Tanya, we're going to be making the, the, the striped, the, Bob, give me the thing again. Striped Pangea. Striped Pangea. Now, it's a, it's a white fish. It's a flaky white fish. You know, we used to call it flounder in the old days. We used to call it everything else. But now it's this white Pangea. So that's that right here, right, Tanya? Yes, sir. Okay, so what, when we make this here at Bahama Bob's, what do we do first? Just put a salt and pepper on. A little salt and pepper. Okay, that's the pepper. You do the salt, I'll do the pepper. All right. Okay, we'll just put that on there. Is that enough? Uh -huh. Okay, good. Salt and pepper. And you just gotta move it in there, and okay. both sides. Both. Both sides. Okay. I'll, okay. You do the massaging of the sh of the, <laughs> and, I'll, and I'll do the. Uh, okay. That's it. All right. Okay. Then that what? Flour. It goes right into the flour. Now, so is that flour also is also seasoned with salt and pepper? Nothing fancy. It's just a really nice salt and pepper. It goes into the egg wash. Right. You put put it through the egg wash, and that's just eggs. And some cream, milk. some milk, just regular whole milk. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then it goes in the secret pan. Now the secret pan, of course, has got you've got the pecans, you've got uh, so we, that's where the crusted comes from. We get the name crusted here at Bahama Bob's. And uh, even though my name is Bob Mosk, as you know, I have not, there's no relation to Bahama Bob. Just want to make that perfectly clear. All right, all right, so, and I do not own Bahama Bob's, but maybe after today, maybe you'll give me a piece of the action. Who knows? All right, all right, then you take that, and then do we, oh, okay, look, look, let's hold that up. Is that not, that already looks good enough to eat, but it's not. Okay, so we do one more that way. Okay, you put it in the flour. Now sometimes uh, do you double put it in the in the egg wash, then back in the flour again? That's too much, huh? That's too much. That's that that's too much uh, uh, something. Too much egg wash, I guess. Okay, and then you dip it in. Now also in the pecans, we've got some cracker crumbs, and that's what makes it kind of it gives it that crusty. Uh, and then when that's cooked, that gives it that extra little crusty, that extra little flavor. Uh, and because sometimes you wonder, you know, that's not just pecans in there. And it kind of makes it, and it gives it a, also it gives it a nice aroma that you wouldn't normally get. And that's a beautiful thing. And then when all of that's done, those go into the fryer. Yes, sir. And then out comes something that is just delicious. And I'm going to show you that right now. Through, this, through the magic of television, here is the plated dish that you get when you come here. Will you look at that? Is that not magnificent? And of course, you got your dressing on the side. You get fries with it uh, and a beautiful roll that comes with it. And then just to give you an idea, I'm just going to take a piece off like this. Boy, that sure is good, Tanya. <laughs> that is really good. But unlike most people, we can actually use a fork and a knife with this. And have a fry. Yeah. And then the, the wonderful drinks. Let me show you something here. Okay. This is, um, what is this, Bob? I think that's, uh, that's a wine spritzer. This is a wine spritzer. That's good, too. I think I'll just put this over here. I'll just put this on the side and put this aside. No, I'm not going to try every single one of these drinks. These are special beverages, adult beverages. You can get right here, but you can get some of these, what we call Shirley Temple for kids. So it looks like it's a, it's an adult drink, but it really is a kid's drink. So we can make any of these drinks here at Bahama Bob's without the alcohol. So kids feel like they're all grown up and stuff, which is really cool. Anyway, thank you, Tanya. You're welcome. Well, with me is the world famous Bahama Bob. <laughs> now, you look like a guy that should be called Bahama Bob. <laughs> well, I, I, I earned that. I used to run around the Bahamas back when I was a young man and yeah. had a lot of fun, worked on boats and sailboats and things. And so, really I mean, the restaurant is so much fun. I mean, it's, it, not only is it a great evening experience, Bob, but it's really a lot of fun to come here because the people are so nice, and the waitresses and all the staff is just so great. And you're always here. Well, I, yes, I'm here, and, and i got a great staff. When I'm not here, they take very good care of people. I've got two partners. They come in and out. Yeah. And they're, they're friends of mine for the last 30 years, so it's been a, it's been a, a real pleasure and just the most fun since since the day we opened. So how long have you been open? About eight years now. About eight years. Yeah. And uh, what the what time do you start serving? We start at 11 o'clock in the morning, and we serve until the people stop coming. So if they come in at it's, 2 o'clock in the morning, well, there's somebody if, if they, we're, they're, they're coming in and we're still open, we're not going to turn them away. That's great. That's great. And uh, that, we're right on, on the water. 
Now we're on the main drag here, which is... Um, uh, this is West Beach Boulevard. Okay, so we're right on West Beach Boulevard. And I mean, like I say, if you've ever come down to Gulf Shores, Fort Morgan, any place, you haven't made it over to Bahama Bob's, you know, go home and spank yourself because you need to come by here. <laughs> well, I don't know. I mean, no, we can see it, but I mean, all you have to do, we're on the deck here. We can look yeah. out and you watch the Gulf of Mexico, the beautiful white sandy beaches. And, and I mean, all the people are here and they're enjoying themselves and you just can't beat the atmosphere. Yeah. It's yeah. great. It's great. And the food is great, too. That's the neat thing about it. Thanks, Bob. Thank you so much for coming. My pleasure.